Shine like a star. Shine like a star. Shine like a star. It's the Shine Like a Star podcast. Shine your light on today's tastemakers and innovators. Keep it with your host, Christopher Boyce. It's the Shine Like a Star podcast. Started one on one magazine exclusive. I got the big homie on the phone with me. Platinum recording artist go by the name of Two Pencil. What's up, brother? How you feel? I'm cool, man. What's up with you? Hey, you know, man, the New Year's here, big dog. How exactly did you uh, bring in the New Year, matter of fact? We went out in any bookings and celebrate with the fam. How'd you bring it to 2014? Yeah, no, I did it with the fam. I just did something real low key and chill, you know, usually always. You know, go out and do an event and do all of that, and I, I just, I just played it different. Uh, I'm, I'm just trying to show that I'm focused, and I really, really want this this time around for me. Uh, I don't want nothing to be in the way, no distractions or nothing like that. So I just focused, yeah. man, on the New Year. That was up. That was up. A little bit of history about you, man. For those who don't know, um, you've been doing this for quite, quite some time, man. Give me a little rundown, a brief history about how long exactly you've been in the game. Um, I'm gonna say like like uh, I jumped in about in the old seven, uh, beginning of the wow. eighties when we when we when we did the real push with when she got it was was the end of old seven. Like I had actually I'm not even gonna say that I'm gonna say oh six because that record was out mm. a year it was out a year in my city before the country got it. The country got it in the end of two thousand seven, beginning of two thousand eight, but it was out in two thousand six in my city for a year. Mm, mm, groovy, groovy, groovy. Um, what's a typical two pistols day, man? I mean, a day in the life, man. If you wake up, is there a particular regimen that you do? Any routine, man? Or, or you, you know, you just get it how you live? I mean, I, I, I roll over, you know what I'm saying? And, and <laughs> the, man ball, man, the man above, man. And, and I might blow one, you know, reflect yes, on sir. what's going on, check the phone, you know what I'm saying? See, see what the business is through the phone, man. Mm-hmm. We, we start our day, man. We get going, man. Go find some breakfast, and, and it'll be a wrap from now. There we go. There we go. 2014 is here, big dog. Um, we know that the album, Arrogant, uh, Arrogant uh, album is out now. It's on iTunes, the new single with French. Um, 2014, what's the new, new, new project we working on? What's, and uh, what can you tell us about that project? I um I got a new project. This title coming back hard. I got like I said, I got the arrogant out right now. I got the debut in stores, the death before the sun in stores. But um mm. I got arrogant, arrogant in the streets, and I got a a project title coming back hard. It'll be out February fourth. I got features with uh Talib Kweli, Jim Jones, uh French Montana, Juicy J. Mm. Uh I got I got I got uh let me see what's I got I got I got the homie Doby on that wrist is uh R I P the Doby. We had, yeah, we had real talk. Our Peter, big homie, crazy. Yeah, yeah. So we got a record together on that torch from uh, mm. and then, uh I got something with uh, well, change drugs too. So yeah, man, I've been working. Man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So oh, fourteen gonna be something stupid. It's gonna be doing another tour. Tour like I know you did the Scream tour. You did the um, tour with DJ Scream last year. That was crazy. Um, any tour in this year or any, any, any that we can look forward to? We got some stuff that we putting together right now. We um been doing basically mm-hmm. spot dates right now, but I mean, I mean, French gonna do. I'm gonna do some dates on French tour. Him and MGK got a tour. Uh, they putting together. Whoa. I'm gonna do some dates on that, and um, I got uh, I got a few a few uh, tours that I'm gonna probably link up with a few different artists. You know, merge on there before I do my own eventually. Nice, nice, nice. Now, I'm gonna flip the script a little bit. It seems to be a lot of um, controversy and violence and killings in the. In the music industry, what's some um, what's some advice you can give these new cats, man? These youngers that that come into the game thinking they can bump them gums, man, and real loose at the lips. Let the let, let the cats know that this shit is real. <laughs> you know, yeah, it's consequences yeah. and repercussions. You know what I mean? And, and what's some advice you can give these new cats, man? Because a lot of people coming in, they talking reckless. They don't have no idea about the business. Uh, um, yeah. So to set the record straight. I mean. See what it is 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 they get mm. in and then they, they they do business with some niggas that might be lame. So then they get in and they get over on them. So then they feel like everybody wow. else is just weak niggas. You know what I'm saying? And they can just mm-hmm. talk to anybody in any kind of way. But it is some real niggas and it's just some sharks out there. 
you know, you cross yeah. path with one of them, I mean, this shit could be serious, me. But, so, niggas, some niggas play it different. Like, an older nigga, you might play it the way he don't even touch you like that. He just cuts your paper off slowly, and then you just die. <laughs> you, you know the OG cash. way. <laughs> yeah, you just, like, you, 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 you die here with no cash. you like, damn, why can't you get that? And it's no, and no, and it's, they shutting all these doors on you, and you, you need your paper drawn up, and you just like, fuck, maybe I still pissed off the wrong mm. person. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. It, it, it's two it's two different ways they can play it, but man, I mean, my my advice is, man, uh, you gotta you gotta pick your battles out here. You gotta choose your choose your battles wisely. I mean, otherwise, there's levels to the shit. Is real talk. Yeah, right? yeah, 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 yeah. Real talk. Yeah, real talk. <laughs> shit is getting too real. I'll be looking at the media, and, the, and I'm in the media. And I am the media, so I look at the shit like, damn, I can't believe the stories I'm covering sometimes. I'm reading about, man. There's a lot of people, you know, they, they're slipping out here, man. It's just like, it's like, a lot of these guys don't understand that this shit is real, the consequences, repercussions of yeah. uh, what's going down out here, you know. So I never, I don't want to keep seeing these, these real niggas go. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, so, yeah. But see, see, that's what it is. That's, that's what it is. They, they, they can't take it and they lose it and they just be like, hey, man, fuck that. I can't take it. You know what I'm saying? They shit, they shit 100. They can be 100 with them, but you can't, you can't do legitimate business if you got somebody faking it, so you got to weed out the fake as much as possible. Mm, mm, mm. Real talk, real talk. Now, you're affiliated with a lot of, or you work with, I wouldn't even say affiliate. Is there any label you can see yourself where you, uh, MMG, I mean, you fuck with everybody, for real, for real. So, is there any big, yeah. big, big label you go like, you know what I mean? Like, you, you're working on something, putting something in the mix where hopefully it's going to Yeah, yeah, I've been, I've, been, I've been talking to a few different people, but what I would like to do is, you know what I'm saying, make my, make my own print, make my own mark to where, with the artists that yeah. I fuck with, we gonna be able to fuck with everybody. It ain't gonna be no, oh, we only gonna fuck with these niggas over there. Like, we just trying to get money, and I want to mm -hmm. help people that's trying to help themselves first and foremost, you know what I mean? And we we can do a mm -hmm. lot of shit together. So I would like to get Real my talk. own print, you know what I mean? Eventually, I get a print yeah. or whatever, and, and put me some artists out. But other than that, I fuck with everybody. I fuck with everybody from East, West, <laughs> West, you know what I'm saying? Everybody down south, yeah. I fuck with everybody, you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 that's what it is, man. Any last shout outs you want to give to anybody in particular, man? Or, uh, um, shout out, matter of fact, Tyra, Tyra, Tyra Thomas Agency. She keep, she keep making sure, make sure you give me this shout out. I got a shout out to you. Yeah, yeah, Tyra, and, uh, yeah, Tyra, you know what I mean? For putting it together. But any last shout outs for you, big homie? And I'll let you go. Um, I'm gonna say, man, I just want to salute everybody that's in my circle, man. We we, we getting it in, man. Shout out to yeah. Empire Management. Shout out to the homie, uh, uh Scott. You know, it's it's been a lot of love, man. Hustle, baby. We doing what we doing, and it's blood, mm -hmm. money, and, and you know, coming back hard February fourth. Real talk. Starting one on one magazine exclusive. We signing off with the homie Big Two Pistols in the building. Twenty fourteen, best in the devils, man. You keep your head out there. Be safe. You holla us anytime you need that magazine shit. For sure, man. You're listening to SLS Podcast with Christopher Boykin. Be sure to subscribe and download this episode and continue to listen to SLS on iHeartRadio or wherever you get your podcasts.